Um, I guess. There you are. This has to go faster. We need those codes. Yes, Bailiff. You do know what's at stake. If Ulysses had had his way, we'd all perish here on Deponia. Yes, Bailiff. Any problems here? No, Prime Controller, sir. Just a relay that short-circuited. This matter is of no concern now. I want to address the crew before we head on to Portofisco. Immediately. As you wish, Prime Controller. You heard the man. Get moving! So we got to steal that cartridge back. Which doesn't seem like it'd be too hard considering they're all walking away from it. It's now or never. But I'm sure there'll be a catch somewhere. Let's go, let's go, 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 get it, get the cartridge. Run! Run, Rufus! You can do it! Grab it! That was too easy, run away. <laughs> that was way, 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 way too easy. What's going on? No, really, what's going on? Uh. Hello. Hello. Um. Oh dear. Surprised, are we? I bet a you little bit. finally made it, huh? Lady uh, Luck loves well, the righteous, so I on and so forth, right? Somewhere. Well, think again, buddy. It's almost ironic. For once in your life, you decide to do the right thing, and immediately you lose everything. <laughs> your dream turns into a nightmare. The love of your life is lost, and your home planet gone. <laughs> I would really love to pity you now, but the cable boat is ready, and the ascension codes have been entered. I don't want to let Elizabeth wait for me any longer. After all, they're expecting a report from me. I could have left already, by the way, but how shall I put it? My back is troubling me. I don't want to do all the rowing by myself. So, hand over the cartridge. Now, Gull's memories about your failed attempt to mess with my plans should still be stored in her short-term memory. I can delete that in a minute. Hand it to me. <laughs> you wish... Um, what is going ah, on here? The Organon, uh, always on time, always reliable. I guess I owe you. I'm apology. stuck in the middle that of a fight didn't here. Swallow your cheese, bailiff. But I'm not an unforgiving person. Once Rufus hands over the cartridge, we'll be able to carry out our scheme as planned. Now more than ever. You heard him, Rufus. Give him the cartridge now. Uh, Come uh, on, Rufus. Be reasonable. I will return to Elysium I, no I, matter what. You can't change that. But if you uh, hand over the data, you'll at least have a chance at saving goal. So what do you say? Do we have an agreement? Uh, never. never! Well, I guess I'll have to row myself then. Too bad. But I should have known that your pride is more important to you than goal's life. <laughs> I bet you already figured out a nice lie to tell her when she wakes up, and then realizes that you've brought her a front row seat for Armageddon. Ah, uh, wait a minute. No, no, don't waste my time. Give me the cartridge or don't. Uh, I'm sure well, we can talk this over. this over. And why, pray tell, should I listen to you? I just want the cartridge. Nothing else. Uh, I, I'll, um... Yeah, I, uh, no, the, yo, okay. no, the, yo, no, the, no, the, the cartridge. <laughs> How unusually reasonable of you. <laughs> and I bet that Gold would be thankful too. Unfortunately, she will never know that you even existed. My, my, my. Deponia will make such a great display of fireworks for our wedding. <laughs> I hate that guy. Cletus? What? What happened? Um, a lot. Uh, uh, can't you remember anything at all? Of course I can remember. I... I... Um... We two were on board an Organon cruiser. We wanted to inspect Deponia, right? We're on Deponia now. Our mission is over. Did I fall asleep? There, there was an accident. You fell from the cruiser. That's why you can't remember anything. But take a look around. Deponia really is deserted. Unbelievable. Nothing but junk. Yes, just junk. Nothing else. Come, let's go home to Elysium. We have to prepare our wedding. Yes, let's go. No, Cole, don't go. He's the bad guy. Honest. Well, that's that, I guess. I'll be on my way, too. The way home to Kuvak is long, and I need to prepare for the apocalypse. 
Not so fast, Sonny. You didn't think we'd let you leave just like that. You know too much. Also, I believe you have something that belongs to us. Oh yes, the cartridge. Hmm. Give it to me. What is it? What are you waiting for? Oops. No! <laughs> so long, suckers. <laughs> Great running animation there. What? Uh, no! This Get isn't that working. Out. Shoot him! Well, my friend, did you lose something? The cartridge. Uh, bravo, Prime Controller, sir. Um. Um. Uh. There's a thing over there. Uh, grab the handles. See you later. No, stop! <laughs> what are you doing? Stop! 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 Ah, you damn fool! Let go! Uh, uh, uh. Uh oh. Well, that was fun. <laughs> oh, right into the needles, really? <laughs> what are the odds of that happening? Back so soon. <laughs> that was a pretty impressive fall. And you managed to land in the pile of needles. Never seen anything like it. You have my respect. I can't imagine that's tremendously pleasant. Everything all right, kid? You seem a bit stressed out. Um, I think I lost a shoe. <laughs> Everything's fine. There. The course is set. Next stop, the floating black market. Good. Great. Fine. Are you alright, Rufus? You sound all tuckered out. You didn't finish telling me what happened up there on the tower. I don't want to be nosy, but... Uh, is Deponia safe? That's out of my hands now. Now look at you startled, the brain implant cartridge has not been swapped, which was all part of the plan. The world has been rescued that he did detest, who'd have guessed, I attest, you'd have done just the same. So if you still want to force me to do stupid chores, like washing the dishes to the trash and such, you'll just prove that you haven't paid attention to what I said. A message at its course like, huzzah as a rule. Huzzah, the chorus guy's rule. And that is the end of Deponia. They've left it as a really open ending. Apparently, I have heard that uh, this game is actually going to be a trilogy. So, that is a fairly open ending for the second one. Man, this was a really awesome point and click adventure. It's been a while. Like, point and click adventures really have gone out of fashion since they. You know, they, they really exploded in popularity in the. Uh, late 90s with, you know, Monkey Island, Discworld, things like that. And then they just kind of, they've kind of faded from popularity in recent years, but I think this is a really good one. And it's good to see that, you know, we can still get really good ones. And man, that was a really downer ending, but hey, Deponia's safe because he switched the cartridge, he switched the backup label, I guess? It's a little bit of a confusing ending. <laughs> but man, at least Deponia is safe once more. And, uh, where actually are we? Because we're on a really, like, clear blue ocean. This can't be on Deponia, right? <laughs> that wouldn't make any sense. All the seas are rusted on Deponia, so, uh, I don't know where we are. But, uh, apparently there will be a sequel of some kind, so... That is something to consider for the future. This has been... This has been a really fun project, I think. Uh, chapters 1 and 3 were definitely highlights. Chapter 2... Well, I've spoken enough about chapter two. Let's not mention it again. <laughs> but yeah, no, this was this was super well written. Like, I think the, throughout the game kind of lacked a bit of polish. I mean, I think I yeah, I don't know. It it, it just felt 
it was a good game, but it felt like it could have been better in certain ways. Like, it, it, better in terms of the polish. Like, there were still some German subtitles. The voice volumes were a bit all over the place and things like that. But ultimately, it was a fantastic little point and adventure. Um, I got most of the achievements. I know there are some achievements that I didn't get because some of them are for doing things first time. Uh, and man, that was super fun. So here's the credits, here's everyone that was involved in the creation of this project. And uh, yeah. I originally created this LP actually as a little bit of a test LP because sometimes, occasionally, I do do little LPs as uh, a kind, kind of like a test of the genre. Just basically because I've always considered uh, point and adventures, you know, they're mostly about the talking, they're mostly about, you know, going off to people, talking to people, and mostly about, like, uh, wandering around not having a clue what you're doing. So I was kind of... Th this LP was kind of a format test to see if I could actually make that into a decent LP series. And I think I've, you know, succeeded marginally. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. This means that essentially in future I can actually do other point and click adventures, maybe. Uh, this, these credits are uh, pretty darn long. Also, one thing I loved about this game, those between chapter songs were amazing. <laughs> I think a lot of the uh, second chapter and third chapter I was mostly playing through just to get to the next uh, end credit song. That was, that was, Those were awesome. Those were very, very awesome. And uh, I think that's the end of the credits. So, okay. Wow, I've been slowly zooming in. I only just noticed. <laughs> well, that's the end for Deponia. So I shall see you next time for something else. Or go check out one of my other projects that I've got on. I usually have like 50 on at once, so there we go. See you next time, folks.